Uh, here's something I've never seen before. This one's called the Survival Series ROG. Encore? Encore Recreational Vehicles. This is a 122BH. Never heard of these guys. I mean, there's a gazillion of these little small teardrops out now, but this one's kind of bigger than normal. Let's kind of fly around the outside first. Interesting. So this must be the kitchen area in the back, I would assume. Oh, it's locked. Yeah, I think that's the kitchen inside there. So you do all your cooking outside. You got a big beefy ladder to get access to your cargo on the top. You got an awning here to keep you uh, dry or out of the sun. You got two doors. That one's locked. I like these fenders. Heavy fenders. Nice big tires. Let's see what the suspension looks like. So, just a torsion bar suspension. You'd think it would be a more uh, advanced suspension like a trailing arm or something like the Australians have. Beefy rack, man. That's probably one of the beefiest racks I've ever seen. LED lights. I like the topographical graphics. Full size spare in the front. That's cool. Heavy duty rack. What is that? A 20 pound propane tank. Just your traditional tow hitch. Here's your access door. It's actually pretty big in here. It's really big for a teardrop. Wow. Interesting. Oh, I see there's a bed up on, on the top and then also a bed on the bottom. So you can actually sleep four people in here. That's cool. It's got a rooftop Dometic AC, LED lights, double pane windows, little storage up here, TV. Looks like it kind of moves around. Here's your, looks like your uh, vents. I'm assuming those are AC vents or heat vents too. Some storage right there behind that white door. Look at all these uh, switches here. Lights, USB, here's your battery. If you want to check your battery. Very cool. Very compact, rugged off-road. You do your cooking outside poop outside, shower outside, but you're safe inside a nice little hard-sided box. That is pretty cool. I don't know how much it costs though.